Hey guys, this is Secret Patrick Dolphin here, and today I'm gonna be doing a movie review. So for this movie review, I'm gonna be reviewing a 2006 animated movie that was made by DreamWorks Animation, and that is Over the Hedge. So the plot of Over the Hedge is basically you have this raccoon named RJ, played by who's who's basically a raccoon trying to to find food, and basically he did he did find food, but he actually stole it from one of his friends who's a bear named Vincent. So basically, an accident, an RJ accidentally, um, accidentally crushed, um, um, Vincent, um, Vincent's food. So basically, Vincent had m made a deal with RJ that if he, he has like, he, ha he has like a week to get off his, to bring off his food back. So basically, um, RJ has, has, um, has to get off his food back. And he does from, from, from going, from meeting up with some other animals that are near, that live near a hedge that's like that that he, that borders a neighborhood, like a neighborhood. So basically, um, RJ meets some uh, meets some f from friends from that from that um from from that um from that um, from that group of animals that are, that live near the hedge, which you have um um her Vern, who's basically like the um um Vern, who's basically like the leader of the animals. You have um. You have um, you have about you have um, you have Hammy, Stella, and some other animals from the in the log too. So basically, um, RJ has a plan that he might that he's going that he had that he's going to steal some of the food some some of the food from the neighbors and that live in that neighborhood that's over the head that's from that's a, that's over that's on the other side of the hedge from the from the animals in the woods. So basically, RJ. Um, RJ, RJ told the animals about the food and some of the things that the that the that the, that the, that the, that the neighbors like, and them and all that animals like it except for the leader, which is Vern, because Vern does not does not like it, and and he, and he thinks that RJ is putting them into danger. So basically, um, RJ ha and and some of uh, RJ and some of the our animals were stealing some food that are that are part that are that are from. That are from um that are from um Vincent's um food list because Vincent that are the food that that RJ had cr actually crushed. So basically, um RJ has to do whatever he can. So yeah, so basically in the film, RJ has to do whatever he can to to get all the food from Vincent and return it to him. So in return to him, while trying to make his our friends and lock safe. So yeah, and also. Also, there. Also, you have some other, and also there are some people that don't like the film. That don't like them. Like they're trying to to stop, like to stop the our animals because so one of the neighbors had called an exterminator, um, uh, to get to to remove the animals. So it's so it's up to like R J and some of his our friends to stop to get all the food while they while they they, they get captured from the exterminator and try stay and try to um give the food. Back to Benson. So yeah, so that's like basically like the plot of Over the Hedge. So what do I think of it? In my opinion, I thought Over the Hedge was a was a good movie from 2006 because this movie this movie was a was a good movie and and I think this movie was overrated. To be honest with you, I think some people say this movie was overrated, and I think I I kind of have to agree with them because this movie was good and I think it, the movie did not have a sequel or anything like a short or a special. Well, it did have shorts. It was called Hannah's Boomerang Adventure, which was like a four minute short, short that came with the DVD release of Over the Hedge. So yeah, so basically, anyway, Over the Hedge was a good movie from 2006. The voice acting did pretty good. You have Bruce Wills who played RJ in the film. You have Steve Carell who played Hammy in the film, The Squirrel. And you have Gary Chandler who played Vern in the film, I think. And Wanda Skies who I think she played Stella the Skunk in the film, I think. So yeah, so basically, so yeah, so basically, I thought Over the Hedge was a was a good movie from 2006, and I think the voice acting was pretty good, the animation was good, the story was good, and the music was good in this film as well. And also, do you know Over the Hedge was based on a, a comic strip by Michael Fry, I think? It was made by Michael Fry, I think that's his name, who made the, the, the strip, the comic strip, because Over the Hedge was basically based on a comic strip. And I think that's one of DreamWorks's um, films that are based on on on, on pop 
on media. Yeah, I think from like a movie or from like a play or book or a car trip or any of, like something like that, like a, from another media. So yeah, so that's like a fun fact about Over the Hedge that's based on a comic strip. A comic strip. So yeah, so basically, so yeah, and also, you guys have been wondering, Hugo Patrick Duffin, have you seen Over the Hedge in theaters? And the answer is, no, I have not seen Over the Hedge in theaters because I was about like a year old when Over the Hedge came out back in May 2006. And I was too like too young to go to the movie theaters that time. So yeah. And also you guys been wondering would I recommend Over the Hedge to a friend? And the answer is yes. I will recommend Over the Hedge to a friend. I will just say give it a watch because I think it's one of DreamWorks' one, one, of the, one of the good DreamWorks movies. Like like one of the best. I think it's one like not the best but it's a, it's a pretty good film. And I think you, I say you, I recommend to you. I think you're gonna you're gonna like this film. It's our DreamWorks original films. Like I think you're gonna like like um like Monsters vs Aliens, Mega Mind, and I think Shark Tale is a, is a like Shark Tale is like a, and Shark Tale as, I think and yeah some other movies as well. I think you're gonna like Over the Hedge, as 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 much as you did to those other movies I said. So yeah, so yeah I think you're gonna like Over the Hedge. So yeah, so yeah guys, and also you guys been wondering, Hugo Patrick Duffin, will you write Over the Hedge? And, they, and I will write Over the Hedge, uh, I will write it, uh, an 8 out of 10. It's a, it's a good movie, and if you've not seen this movie, I recommend you watch it, because in to my opinion, I think you're gonna like this movie as much as you like, uh, as you like drinks, as, as you like, as much as you like drinks movies, so yeah. So yeah guys, I'll see you guys. So yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoy this movie review, so that's it for this movie review, so make sure you like the video, comment the video, share this video to all your friends and family, and most importantly, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more videos of Hugo Patrick Delphin. So yeah guys, I'll see you guys in the next video, so hope you guys enjoyed the vi hope you guys enjoyed this video, so I'll see you guys in the next video, so goodbye everybody, and that's about it from Hugo Patrick Delphin.